Glue goes, it's we 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 love it. I'm sure they feel the same way with Verlander. Um, I think as an organization or a team, you do what you think puts you in the best position. If that's to have an opener, that okay, that you know again. But I know how we feel with Kluber pitching, and it's it's good, and he's earned that. Same with Verlander. But if if for some reason it changed and you, we had to have somebody, you know, again, you're just trying to. Sometimes you you have to think outside the box to get where you're going. If we have to do that at some point, maybe we will. Not, as far as Klub goes, it's we, we, we love it. I'm sure they feel the same way with Verlander. Um, I think as an organization or a team, you do what you think puts you in the best position. If that's to have an opener, that okay. That you know again. But I know how we feel with Kluber pitching, and it's it's good, and he's earned that. Same with Verlander. Sometimes you you have to think outside the box to get where you're going. If we have to do that at some point, maybe we will. Not tomorrow. It's Justin Verlander and, and myself, but in the end, it's it's me pitching against their lineup and him pitching against our lineup. You know, we're we're never gonna truly face off against each other in the game. So you know, I think that. In the postseason, regardless of who you're facing, you know things are always magnified. This is what we play for: is is to have a chance in the postseason and try to win a championship. And so I think that every time that you get that opportunity, you embrace it and you look forward to it, whether it's coming off of a year where you won it all or you didn't. He's got a scouting report, and we got a scouting report against him as well. But at the end of the day, um, it's not a guy that I've never seen. I know what he likes to do. I know kind of the way he likes to pitch. Um, we just got to go out there and execute. Execute, continue to um, stay within our approach. And if we don't have success the first at bat, second at bat, you just um, continue to make an, um, a custom adjustment throughout the at bats, throughout the game, and uh, hopefully uh, we'll be successful. I mean, it's going to be emotional. You're going to have adrenaline going. Everybody's going to be excited. It's, uh, I think what you garner from being there before is learning how to harness it and use it for good. And uh, understanding that uh, there's going to be ebbs and flows to each game. Uh, they're going to make some runs. We're going to make some runs. And it's trying not to get too hot. Get extra uh, motivated when you come up with a big time pitching matchup like you're having tomorrow? No. You know, the way that I look at it is, you know, it's Justin Verlander and, and myself, but. In the end, it's it's me pitching against their lineup and him pitching against our lineup. You know, we're we're never gonna truly face off against each other in the game. So you know, I think that in the postseason, regardless of who you're facing, you know, things are always magnified.